This is our claim. Clear out, Civvy. Excuse me. We don't need any more hired guns. Will you leave already? Once we get on that ship, we're set for life. I don't have time for the likes of you. This is our claim. Clear out, Civvy. Hey. Payday better be coming soon. You're doing what? You don't have the authority to do that. We are in desperate times, madam. Proclamation 22 allows all crew members to conscript citizens for the war effort. The captain requests your presence on the bridge. Cut the double quick, madam. Junk, as far as I'm concerned. Everything's gotta use. Almost morning. Good. Thanks to high heaven. This is the captain speaking. We're taking on an allied soldier. Clear the berth. Disable the fences. Overdue for maintenance. Identified. Intruder. 
intruder. Mr. First Mate, this is the captain. This soldier is no intruder. Requesting permission to use lethal force. Whoa, whoa. Easy there. Unable to comply. Stand down! That's an order! And for God's sake, use the accent! I, Captain. Standing down. Standing down. Fine place to hunker down. Maintaining present course. Captain. I'll have none of your lip, Mr. Navigator. Have the crow's nest scan two points off the port bow. Jump to it. Aye, Captain. Our soldier has arrived. I trust the first mate didn't give you too hard a time. Been too long since we've seen the congressional army. Do not think that diminishes my resolve. Thanks for calling him off me. The scan shows you have the proper number of appendages still, so all is well. I am Captain Ironsides, commander of the USS Constitution. You visit this fine vessel in trying times. Be calm these long years on her airy perch. Damn you, Weatherby Savings and Loan! I spit at you. A sad state of affairs for such a historic ship. On that, we are in agreement. What vexes me most is my inability to assist in the war effort. My gun decks have not but Morats and ne'er-do-wells as targets. Enough pleasantries. The Constitution has systems that need repairs to carry out its mission. If I help you... I expect part of the payment, up front. What a singular request! Were you in the Navy, I would remind you of your oath. But, as a soldier, I will authorize a performance bonus payable immediately. Consult with the ship's person. Consult with the bosun and Mr. Navigator. They will relay your instructions. Dismissed. Our look lively, lads. Scavengers approach. Soldier, man the cannons. Kill them only as a last resort. A few warning shots. You See what's left. Your objective is attempting to evade cancer. Beginning pursuit.
Ahoy, soldier! Scavenger threat eliminated. Damage assessment will commence after this unit has completed scheduled duties. Why did the scavengers attack? Scavengers have attacked ship 17 times. Destroyed 13% of ship's systems. Stole 5% of ship's store. Logic error. Captain's orders authorize scavenger termination only if necessary to preserve the ship. You robots do a good job of defending your ship. Proclamation 1. Defend the Constitution by any means necessary. Guidance system offline. Multiple errors diagnosed. First error. Guidance chip stolen. This unit requires its return. Who stole your guidance chip? Guidance chip is one entry on the list of stolen items. Reclaim chip at Scavenger's forward recon station. Captain has approved a bounty for its return. Lethal force is prohibited, unless absolutely necessary. Aft dinghy unlocked and available for your use, madam. Hey there. Don't shoot! Those assholes didn't attack the ship on our orders. They weren't trying to frag ya anyhow. They just wanted to kill the frickin' robots. So, they were scavengers, but not with you. Well, they were kinda with us. I mean, we're not really used to working together. It's not like anyone is in charge. But we do have an agreement. Everyone works together, gets an equal share. When you waltzed aboard the ship, those assholes just kind of lost it. They broke our agreement and paid for it. How did you get aboard anyway? We thought you were going to get cratered for sure. He knew I was an American, so he drafted me. America? Isn't that some old world mumbo jumbo? Whatever. So you got to see the inside, huh? All that salvage, the real motherload, just waiting to be stripped and sold. Is all the junk inside really that valuable? Well, yeah, we could keep Diamond City in parts for months with all them gizmos. We'd never have to scrounge in the gutter again. So you talked with a tin can. What do you have to say? Ironside says you stole a guidance chip. He wants it back. His guidance chip, right. You know what he needs it for? His rockets. The huge goddamn rockets on the side of his boat. He's nuts. I'm sure there's a good reason he needs them. You seriously want to help that idiot bolts for brains? Screw that robot and come work with us. There's Dozens more of us nearby. It's only a matter of time before we come out on top. I'm not splitting my share with her. You holding out on us, Davies? You got some magical way in there? This lady's got a free ticket aboard, so shut up. Help us destroy that freaking tin can once and for all. No deal. I'm with Ironsides. Then screw you, asshole. You're lucky we don't gun you down. Payday better be coming soon. Orders are pretty clear about things. Nothing personal. <laughs> And all the Sharp eyes and steady hands, Captain. Yeah. Thought about Help me! Well, then, oh. what's next? Got a hope. 
Heaven Hill! I'll be drinking a toast to your corpse! What, ain't you had enough yet? Exercise that. Your very presence does this humble unit a great honor. My programming would find it amiss if I did not also interject. Long live the captain! You certainly have pep. Much obliged for the compliment, but on to the mission of the day. Our last marine expedition valiantly returned with much needed supplies, including replacement power cables, madam. Alas, with my severe lack of appendages, I find myself unequal to the task of repairing the cables myself. I'll get right on it. My anxiety emulators are lightning by the microsecond. Once you have resolved this matter, I beseech you to return to me to accept my undying gratitude. Rolling. Hey, Bosun. How? Course is through the Constitution's veins. Again! Her systems, long starved, flick out to life! <laughs> A hearty congratulation. Huzzah! However, this has brought to light further failures in our power grid. The power relay, to my shame, I previously complained about is fluctuating wildly. Don't worry. I'll get you up and running. Willie for you, madam. Power relay coils are a common enough part. Might I recommend checking the local shopkeeps? Surely they would be of some assistance. Fair winds and following seeds. Patrolling. Hey, Bosun. Power flow 
goes far and steady. I would applaud you, but alas, I cannot due to my lack of clapping instruments. But huzzah, madam, huzzah! Well, you're very welcome, Osun. You are too kind. I require no further assistance. But our Mr. Navigator is also beset by troubles. Scuttle buddies, our guidance system is on our last legs. If you've not already, speak to him. Fare thee well. Solid walls here, Captain. Oh, it's well. Defending the Constitution. Ahoy, soldier. Ship recovered. Dispensing bounty. Diagnostics report. One error remaining. Guidance radar's transmitter is not functional. Requires replacement. What's wrong with the transmitter? Diagnostic inconclusive. No functioning Mr. Handy's available for detailed analysis. Acquire Poseidon radar transmitter at specified map coordinates. Further bounty will be dispensed upon completion, madam. Ooh, that smell. Wish I had one of them pre-war breath masks. Okay, well... If the scavengers keep seeking folly and destruction, stick the I will be reluctantly obliged. All this thing... At current speed, we will arrive at destination in... Okay, it's repair transmitter. Undefined. Ours. Talk to the navigator. All is well. Um, let's get a look. Where are you, Mr. Navigator? I'm rolling. No, the side. Warning. Overdue for maintenance. Where is this navigator? He was here a second ago. Where is the navigator? There he is. What's going on here? Circuit breaker. Okay, I don't want to touch it yet. Ahoy, soldier! Guidance system fully functioning. Bounty dispensed. It is required you commence dialogue with the captain, madam. Okay. Okay, I inside. I think you need to cool down. Captain Ironsides. You've been of service to our noble vessel. Despite ample provocation, I had hoped the guidance ship could be recovered without violence to the scavengers. And now they plot the retaliation. Mm -hmm. I would have spared them if I could have. I have no doubt that they made a peaceful resolution impossible. But you did your duty and did it well. I find I must reward your considerable efforts with the final labor. You stand but a hair's breadth away from embarking on our sacred mission. I'm always... Happy to help. I would expect nothing less. The ship requires turbo pump bearings from a nearby factory. It will undoubtedly be a dangerous mission, but I have faith you will succeed. Hey, this fine was built turbo pump land. bearings. Okay, so where do I go to find turbo pump bearings? Uh. Fort Hagen. Oh, 
That doesn't make any sense. Okay, well, I uh, suppose we have to go find some bearings. So I'm going to head to Fort Hagen. Okay, we have found the bearings that we need. Uh, there we go, thank goodness. What crazy, now this wasn't here before. The last time we were here in Fort Aiken was when we took on Kellogg. And now we have to go all the way back again. So I will see you guys uh, back at the ship, if I can find it. Okay, finally back at this ship. Uh, Oh yeah, right, we can use the the back entrance, so to speak. So let's go up there. See, it automatically comes down, that's fantastic. Well, Longfellow, you need to watch what you're doing. Um, okay, hold a sec, what am I actually supposed to do here now? Uh, install the bearing. Okay, where do I install this bearing? There's an inside. Seems to be. Okay, there we go. Somewhere over here. It is an honor to crew such a story vessel. If you say so. Okay, I see there's a lot of goodies in here. Ah, here we go. Uh, activate. Install turbo pump. Alright, close the lid, and talk to the captain again. Okay, I don't know why the captain's got a room if he doesn't actually use it, but either way. Okay, well let's go back to the captain. Hey, captain! Captain! Trim the power on the starboard bow. Steady as she goes, Mr. Navigator. Luck willing, at long last, we'll set sail. And our hero of the hour is to thank. You've earned a double share, madam. Well done. Okay. Set sail. On the eve of our voyage, the need for secrecy is long past. Our twin NX-42 rockets will alight and then moor us from this dreaded savings and loan. The Constitution will launch into the heavens, and after, gently land in the ocean. Then we take our rightful place as defenders of the Atlantic. Um. You're gonna what? A thing of brilliance, is it not? Mr. Navigator, put her through her paces. We need to... Those motherless curs! Prepare to broadside! Defend the Constitution until our... Uh, these guys again. Everything. That's what happens when you I'm mess with me. Well, that's not a nice way to do it. Guys, come from. Okay, now all the bad guys are dead, and after some uh, technical difficulties, we are back up and running. 
And I think we gotta speak to a captain. Okay, captain. Gods be good, the scavenger assault has been broken. Not one of those scallywags stepped foot on our vessel. All hands, prepare ship for launch. Okay, still doing this. You're still going through with this? Given time, the scavengers will regroup. It may be now or never. We need power from the auxiliary generator to commence our voyage. I fear I must call upon you one last time. Okay. Consider it done. I admire your pluck. Here is your amply deserved reward. Godspeed to you, madam. Okay. A uh, broad cider. And does what exactly? Not sure. Okay, fire up auxiliary power. Uh, this is showing me... At current speed, we will arrive at destination in undivided hours. Okay, I'd have to go down. Okay. Hey, there's two people around here. All right, quit your hiding. Where are you guys coming from? Ammo. See what's left. What the heck? It's like a whole pile of them lying here. Ah, uh, got something there. Ah, uh, they seem to just land up on that corner. Okay, where is the auxiliary pump thing? Uh, up here. Okay, let's see. Anything else around here? How do I go up? Up, stairs, stairs, ways. Here we go. That's a shower. There we go. Even further up. Well, let me just have a quick look around here. Something from before the war, looks like. Yes, okay, yes. Stairs. A couple of things to loot. Don't tell me that's the generator. What the heck happened here? That can't be the generator. Ah, okay, Mr. Handy is kaput. Mr. Navigator, slowly throttle the engines. Okay. Keep idling those engines. Switch that off. Circuit breaker. Voice order. Ah, fire auxiliary power. power. Excellent. Commencing final countdown. It's going there, but... Three. No. This is going to be interesting. Credit savings alone. We shall be more no longer. We are away. Whoa. There she goes. Two points to starboard. Holy crap. <laughs> that makes a difference. the building. Uh, you gotta be we kidding me. Victory at last. Helm reports we are a quarter fathom closer to the Atlantic. By my calculations, in a mere century we will take to the ocean. Oh well my done. gosh. If you guys were in water, you could have just gone out here. The ocean is right there. Okay, well, it looks like we're going to have to go all the way to there and find out what's cooking. Um, 
Okay, well, now that's another story. Now, to get this. Let's take a shortcut. Well, guys, this is the closest <laughs> I can get to the ship after it took off now. And, uh, yeah, there's no other way up here. And the building itself is busy glitching. You can see the paint of the walls doing funny thing. But uh, that is the end of the quest. And uh, if I go in here, there's nothing else now. Yeah, so... I don't know when they plan on getting back to the Atlantic, but anyway, thanks for joining me and I'll check you guys next time. Cheers.